Did you, is this like the, like the low point of the tour in terms of like energy? Yeah. Like, Dude, it's just like, like the any, end and any, you're just... Any well, day. What happens, yeah, what happens is like every day you wake up down here and you want to plan your ascent so that you hit right when you hit the stage. Right. So that like the whole day is down. It sucks. And then you save every ounce of energy until the, until the time it is to spend it. And then you just plummet once more, and each time you fall farther and farther. And so this is the last this is day plummet. 11. We're gonna have one more ascent, and then we're all gonna die. Yeah. <laughs> Cheap I champagne combo. Cool yeah. Fucking playing some shows. Yeah, man, it's been super, super, super fun. What was the best city so far? What was the best? No, New York. I mean, New York chewed us up and shit us up. I don't up, know, but... man. I mean, New York was cool, but I think in terms of our show was no. was Tufts. Yeah, we, we did a Tufts, Tufts party. Was you guys went to Tufts. Great. We yeah. went to a Boston frat and, yeah. the, and they had no idea. We set up in a room that was like the size of a bathroom. Like, like it was four hours tiny. beforehand. <laughs> set up a ten-piece band and rocked for like, you know, fifty people at a house party that had no idea we were coming. Yeah, and like, by the end, it was like the sick. whole place was shaking, like physically we like, shaking. It was sweet. It was fun. Yeah, I was actually we afraid the walls were gonna. Yeah. We thought we but, like, there might be some infrastructural. Damage. Did they recycle in Kingston? I haven't seen any recycling. I haven't, yeah, fucking but sustainable engineers, my ball. signature thing is that Busty brings to a show? Like, what's signature Busty? Just live ass energy. Um, you know, at every single show that we've played so far, we have people coming up after us, and it's just like, that is the most unreal live experience I've ever had. And that's really what we're going for. Because, you know, people people go out dancing to clubs, they, they rock dubstep house, but you really, you know, there's nothing that compares to having four horns in your face blasting and, and, a, and a rhythm section crank into 11. Uh, it's, it's, you know, that's what we go for and that's what we're trying to get out. Bringing, bringing the life back to nightlife. You, you can look at it. Sure, so just like introduce yourself, I'm Milo, I do the bass, and then something funny or interesting about yourself that people don't oh, know. Oh, fuck. Give me a second, give me a second. <clears throat> What's something funny? <laughs> hmm. 
Yeah, yeah, a little bit about me. Um, what they do I don't know what the hell do I say. <laughs> do you have a, anything? Are you, you think it's gonna be edited? I assume. Yeah, yeah. Okay, good. Whenever you're ready. My name is Eric. I play piano and also guitar, and I am the ambassador of love. Hey, I'm Nick. I play saxophone, and I eat salads after the main course. Yes, I do. Oh, My name is Scott Bevins. I play trumpet in Busty and the Bass. Um, I don't have a very good sense of smell, which has been really helpful on this tour. Uh, I'm Evan. I play the keys. I do some hype. Um, I'm from Victoria, British Columbia. That's the West Coast. For those Americans that don't know, um, I really like Magnum. If you could ever have a tattoo, what would it be? Where would it be? If I could have a tattoo, I think it would probably be my, on my ass. And I would probably say Busty in the Bass. My name is Milo, I play bass, and I never set my microwave for multiples of five or ten. <laughs> it's, it's Tim Hortons coffee and Pepsi. Are you the ambassador of love? Yeah. yeah. Is, this, is it yeah. Someone's got to do it. Yeah, so thankfully I've got some dudes, uh, some talented ass musicians, so in our downtime, it only makes sense to just keep on making music, so right now I'm going to have uh, the trombonist Chris Vincent laid down a trombone part for a uh, song on the upcoming album I have coming out with Claire, so it should be, should be really nice. Tromboner. Yeah. Tromboner. My name is Chris Vincent, I play trombone, and I'm very proud to say that in my next life I'll uh, probably be an Olympic swimmer. My name is Mike McCann, and I'm a trumpet player, and if I wasn't, I would be a newscaster. <laughs> I'm Julian, I play drums, I'm from Los Angeles, and I hate salad. My name is Louis, Louis Stein, I'm from New York City. I play the guitar and busty and the bass. I uh, love this band, and I will take whole wheat noodles over egg noodles any day. I love Pokemon. <laughs> I love OG 151 Pokemon. Okay, just say. Hey there, how's it going? My name is Benj. I am a singer-songwriter, uh, born in New Jersey, raised in Toronto. And, interest and an interesting fact about me is that I really get down with original Game Boy Color versions of Pokemon with the original 151 Pokemon. That's an interesting thing. This is my favorite part of the whole set. And 
this is my favorite gig we've ever done. So that means that this is a special moment for everyone in this crowd right now. When this shit drops, we're gonna lose our shit, I promise you. Cause we're gonna have a lot of fun. This is Busty in the Bass. Thank you all for rocking with us. It can't mean more to us, I promise you. We'll be back before you know it. Let's go everybody, let's go. I wanna feel it with you, come on. Press up with me all, press up with me all. Oh, baby, I love 